Hey guys, so just before this video starts, I just want to talk about a few things real quick. Thank you guys so much for 21,000 subscribers. We hit 20k not that long back, and now we're up to 21k, and soon 22. So 30k is the next big milestone, and we'll be going further and further. I'm happy to celebrate the 10th episode of this show, which was the Clutch Powers episode last weekend. So as a little bit of a bonus, and as a little special, this isn't an episode, more just like a little TV special, if you would, for Q&A. So I'm going to answer some questions you guys gave me a few weeks ago. And uh, before that, though, I have a bit more interesting bits of information to give you guys to look forward to. So um, we're going to be getting a new character on the show. Not going to tell you exactly who she is or what she is, but it is a female. And it is going to be an interesting character that plays into a dynamic with Lubot a lot. Um, Spooky is going to make more of an appearance. We have new backgrounds that you'll be seeing in this video. Um, and just a whole bunch of other quality of life improvements. As you've noticed in the last episode's credits, I have a team now that helps me out with editing and writing. So things should hopefully be moving a lot smoother, and going into September, and especially October, there will be a lot of content coming. We're going to be making sure that every Sunday there is at least one episode of the show. So thank you guys, and I hope you enjoy the Q&A. Guys, get over here. We're doing a Q&A. A Q and what? Questions and answers. Do I have to? Yes. So not only do I have questions for me, but questions for you two as well. Questions for us? Yep. Here's one for you, Spritzy. What's that cutie mark of yours mean? Uh, it, it's a bottle of alcohol. I make booze for every pony. What, what kind of fucking question is that? The same person had a question for Lubot. Fantastic. Were you created for specific purposes or just for funsies? Protocol 3, protect the pilot. That's certainly a good question, but we'll, we'll have to revisit that someday. I promise, though, when we do, it'll be important. Let me see that. It's your turn. Butters, what is your favorite German dish? Spätzle. Give me that back. Lubot. Can you change the frequency of your voice to fit emotions? My voice is usually more expressive, but the main drivers for my voice have been shut down for months, so until they're brought back online, the backup is sufficing. TLDR, 15 AI has been down and it's annoying. Spritzy, why did you move in with Lubot and Butters? Spritz. Where did I go wrong? Spritzy. Did I know Alright, another one for me. Butters, are you aware Lubot may have a crush on Dumsville? Do you? Is he made of metal? No. Then no dumbass. Dear Lubot, uh-oh. What's your favorite saw trap? The reverse bear trap. Should I be concerned that you answered that so quickly? The concern you should have is how much resistance the skull of an equine has versus a 50 caliber bullet. Lubot, you pointed that thing at me like five times. It's unloaded. I'm literally staring down the barrel. Lucy won't buy me any bullets. This is why. You win this round, horse. For Lubot, what caused you and Mechagodzilla to break up? Fuck off. Okay. For Spritzy, what was it like being raised in Equestria? Oh, uh, not too bad, but that television show you guys somehow have about Equestria called My Little Pony or some shit doesn't, uh doesn't cover everything. What do you mean? Well, you, you humans call them grimdarks, but some of them, yeah, they happen. Which ones? I don't think we're allowed to say. Butters, read this one away from Lubot. Do you have a contingency plan in case Lubot goes a bit, well, terminatory? Excuse me. Well, one, I don't buy her ammunition. Two, I give her chocolate when she gets mad. I do love chocolate. Specifically for Lubot. How much tomato sauce do you put on your spaghetti? And do you eat meatballs? Well, I do enjoy a lot of sauce and meatballs, but only when Lucy makes it. Oh, you like my cooking? What no I- For Spritzy. Where is the $50 I lent you last week? You said you'd pay me back by now. Hey, hey, don't get fussy with me, Jabba. I had to dump my cargo. An Imperial fleet was in the sector. What? But, but we don't even have a spaceship. Yeah, we do. I, well, I mean, we did. For me, from a person. I saw you with the laser sword, so I have a question. What's your favorite Star Wars movie? Oh, that's easy. Episode 3, Revenge of the Sith. Oh, you also enjoy child murder. Kinda. Is your toaster plotting against you, or am I the only one with this problem? Huh. Uh, Lubot? We have nothing to worry about. Normal is a little bitch. <laughs> That's mean! You know what else is mean. 
unplugging you. I'm sorry. That's what I thought. Now make my goddamn toast. David says, why do you let Spritzy live with you? Cause she's my best friend on good days. What am I on bad days? An enemy of the state. Oh yeah. Will you commission some R34 for your sprite, and when will we get an Arara? I've considered getting it from really high profile artists as some form of exposure, but never went through with it. Though I'm not against R34 art of my characters. And for the Arara, if someone sends me 150 bucks, I'll do it in the most lewd voice I can possibly muster, but until then, <laughs> nope. What is your favorite genre of music? I'd have to say symphonic death metal, like Interdimensional Summit. How many countries is Spritzy one? In. More countries than there are countries on the planet. This is from someone I actually know. One of your goals from your GoFundMe is listed as vocal feminization surgery. Do you plan on doing any vocal training before that? Yes, actually, I'm going to look into it, and if voice training doesn't work, I'll go with the vocal surgery. But I'm definitely getting an Adam's apple reduction and a facial feminization surgery. I think that's enough questions for now. I'd like to thank you guys very, very much for making The Butter Show a relatively great success for my channel, especially at my channel's size. We've been growing fairly well, and with the previous week, I've celebrated our 10th episode. 10 whole episodes have been released in the four months of the show's existence. There will be many, many more episodes to come. I hope we can smash 30,000 subs real soon. I love you guys very much, and thank you.